Follow me on the road to wait loss. This will be perfect. Here you go, Mandy. Kisses. Are you trying to sabotage me? <laughs> you give me a basket of fruits. I had a huge serving of vegetables this morning. Tomatoes, mushrooms, kale, and chickpeas, and two eggs. Mandy had some cut up fruit this morning. Mangoes and pineapple and strawberries. For lunch I had asparagus, mushrooms, and spinach. Mandy had chicken tortilla soup. I am very full, like for real. And all I've really had is like vegetables. So that's really crazy that that is even possible. I just, you know, I mean, I had two eggs in the morning, so I don't know if that counts, but <laughs> I guess it does count. It is meat or whatever. It's not vegetables, but I'm just so uh, weirded out because I don't, I'm not hungry right now, and I'm actually full because I ate, you know, asparagus and all that, so it's mind-boggling, but it's really true, and um, so if you want to start eating more vegetables and cutting out the meat, it is doable you just have to eat the hearty green leaves not like the the iceberg lettuce or anything you gotta make sure you're eating the hearty 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 green vegetables and change it up because um i was eating spinach a lot and now that i incorporated uh, asparagus and mushrooms i am very pleased very very well pleased let's get this walk on I did about 30 minutes of cardio, walking slash jogging. I did twice as long of jogging than I did yesterday. So that probably only equals about a minute, but hey, it's progress. And then I came over here and did some stair steppers and did some squats and some side crunch uh, workouts. And um, I feel great. I didn't have anybody here to push me other than myself. And then I was thinking about all of y'all's encouragements and comments and I didn't want to let y'all down, so I just pushed myself as far as I could go, and um, it feels great to actually push myself, and this has just been a big accomplishment uh, accomplishment to continue to work out, and I feel great after two weeks. So for dinner tonight, um, my brother came over, and so I got distracted, and I forgot to film or take pictures of any of my dinner, but I wanted to let y'all know what I had. I had grilled uh, a grilled turkey and some steamed broccoli and some wheat uh, couscous. It was very delicious, and even my brother, who does not eat healthy, he really enjoyed it. So I'm glad that I could cook something healthy for him. I gotta buy a new TV since mine broke, you know, gotta get my Just Dance back on. What kind of videos did you get? Let me just tell you. Just go with it. Funny movie. 21 Jump Street. Oh my gosh, Funny man. movie. The Heat. Hilarious. The Town. This is a good movie. Identity Theft. Hilarious. And that's the top. <laughs> wow. It's a lot of movies. Tomorrow is ice slash snow day equals movie day. If anybody has any recipe ideas, if so, please comment down below and uh, let us know your what y'all use for salad dressings, whether it be something in the store or something that y'all make. I would greatly appreciate any suggestions. Thank you. This is the problem with being short. I'm trying to get some water out here. Mandy, can you help me? Sure. Mm -hmm. What do you like? <laughs> uh, four. Can this you get could four? be a problem. Sure. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I got two. <laughs> this might be a problem, guys. She's on the, <laughs> on the step. Are you recording? Yeah. <sighs> got it? Got four. It. Four. Egg beaters, triple cheese. Just what I've been looking for. How they put cheese up in there? We just did a haul at Target and we were excited because we got all great ingredients and we trying to look for some um, salad dressing stuff, but we were unsuccessful, I think. We got some vinaigrettes, but we need your help. Like she said before, leave a comment down below. Tell us something that, like a salad dressing or something that we can use um, to put in salad. Yeah. <laughs>
but it has to be healthy and nutritious and not processed so please help transformation tuesday transformation tuesday what 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 what, 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 what. so what that means is we weigh in and we, we find out our results every week we do a weigh in and tomorrow will be our week so you'll get to see how much we lost and that is fun isn't it yes yes tomorrow is like an ice snowy day so i don't have to go to work but i'm still gonna wake up really early and go to weight watchers and weigh in because i'm so excited Ooh. so i can't wait but since it is a snow ice day it's supposed to get worse throughout the day so we may not be able to meet up and uh, do pictures like we normally do um, but if we don't we're still going to put out a video and uh, revealing our weight loss so definitely tune in because there will still be some ex exciting results hopefully i hope so yeah uh, crush your fingers maybe. we will see, see y'all tomorrow Yes, so thank you for all your encouragement and continue to like and comment and share. And uh, just thank you for everything. Subscribe. Down below. And, and remember the question. Remember right. the question, answer it. All right, thank you. Bye. Bye. Hey, Ken, so how, how have you lost weight? All right, I'm going to tell you exactly how I've lost weight. Um, I'm not exactly where I want to be, but I used to be a much larger man. Um, and I did it with a very, very easy step. All I did was drink loose leaf green, white, and oolong tea, four to five cups a day. Um, you do it for a month to a month and a half. The average person I know has lost 10 to 15 pounds in that first month. Um, it's not an exact science. People lose different amounts of weight. It, it all depends on your body type. Um, but I can, from my personal experience, this is what I've seen. So let me tell you what it's gonna do. What the white tea is gonna do is white tea, first of all, is not fermented. Um, and so what that's going to mean, it's only going to have 1-2% to the caffeine of a cup of coffee. It's going to be high in antioxidants, it's good for your skin complexion, detox, body hydration, and it's the only tea that can hydrate you. Um, and then that green tea in there, what that's going to do, um, a lot of green teas are going to contain vitamins A, B, C, K, potassium, iron, and chlorophyll. Um, not all green teas, but if you go with a higher grade, shade grown green tea, what the chlorophyll is going to do is it's going to help cleanse and detox your blood. Um, just like the white tea, it's going to have antioxidants, good for your skin complexion, body detoxification. It's going to contain the ECCG complex, um, and that's going to help support your metabolism and your digestive system. It's going to help out with your blood pressure, um, help out with the bad cholesterol. It's also going to help out with inflammation, so it's very, very good to drink after you jog because um, your knees are hurting, all of that. It's going to help out with that arthritis. And then the oolong tea, it's going to be fermented a little bit longer than the green tea. It's going to have about 10 to 15 percent of the caffeine of a cup of coffee. Um, and what it's going to do is it's going to have a high amount of tannic acid. It's going to support your digestive system. Um, what that tannic acid is going to do is it's going to harden your digestive lining. Um, so it helps out with things such as acid reflux, ulcers. That's what it helped me out with. Um, and then it's gonna it's gonna help your body metabolize carbohydrates. Um, so the sugars, pasta, stuff like that you take in, it's gonna help your body turn into turn into energy a lot quicker. Um, so again, just four to five cups a day. If you do loose leaf tea, you can generally re-steep it six or seven times, so you can get a lot of uses out of it, save a lot of money, and it is incredibly healthy. Um, so you're gonna feel a lot better, look a lot better, and it's easy. It's as easy as drinking tea. Thanks, Ken. You're welcome. I fixed myself some of the passion tea that I got tonight, so let's see how it tastes. Mm, ah, ooh, it's hot, hot. I can't taste it yet. Hot, hot. My tea has had a little time to cool down, so let's see how it tastes for real this time. good it's still a little hot but it is very good it tastes very flowery like lots of flowers if that's what flowers would taste like I've never tasted real flowers but it is it's really good so I look forward to drinking my tea